Hello everyone, my name is Igusti Ajipita Amara Putri and I'm from class 11 from 7 Nipa. So today I'm staying here to tell you a story about the little red riding hood. Maybe some of you know about this story, but this story that I want to tell you had a different ending. So let me start the story right now. One day, the little Red Riding Hood's mother asked her to bring a basket of goodies to her grandma's house. The little Red Riding Hood agreed that he go to the grandma's house. She really enjoyed her trip. But suddenly, there's something apparent in front of her. Do you know what I said? That is a wolf. And this wolf said to the little Red Riding Hood, Pardon me, you accompanied little girl. I couldn't help but notice you uh, by yourself, traveling alone through this dark and scary forest alone. Yeah? Say the little bit riding hood, suspiciously. Where are you headed with that? Delicious smiling basket of goodies, said the wolf. The little red riding hood knows how crafty and dangerous wolf can be. So she come up with a clever plan. I'm headed to my grandma's house. It's right the path on that direction. But I can stay in charge. My poor, sick, feeble, vulnerable grandmother is waiting for me. It's right the end of that path. That way. Yep. It's a little good riding hood. After that, the wolf said to the little good riding hood. How delicious of I mean how dedicated of you, but my daughter coming to take time to gather some wonderfully beautiful flowers for your grandma, Hugo. There are many flowers just slightly off the path, said the wolf. After that, the little green riding hood answered her. So, you think I should bear slightly off the path to gather flowers? Take the little red riding hood. Yes, the delay will definitely be worth it. <laughs> Say the wolf will smiling and giggling by himself. Well, thank you. I'll be sure to bear that in mind. Say the little red riding hood. Please do. I'll be sure your grandmother will be very surprised, said the wolf. After that, the little red riding hood go to the wood, to the bear house, to out with the wolf, then see rather back to the right path. After a few moments later, a little red riding hood arrive at his grandma's house safely. And how about the wolf? Of course, he made a free, scary bear, and no one knows what happened to her after that. The moral is, always be careful and don't easily trust new people that you meet. Okay? So that is the end of this story. Thank you very much for listening. I hope you enjoy. Goodbye and see you later. Awesome.